Look at my armor. And look at my tools. Something wrong, isn't there? Yep, it's definitely something wrong. So, yesterday I was working on uh, my track in the Nether Hub. And um, I was, uh, you know, mining out a couple of blocks that I was replacing with some logs. And of course, there was a pigman on my track that was in the way. Walked in front of my pickaxe, so I hit him. And uh, I aggroed him, but I killed him. And um, after that, I actually used a minecart, which is a stupid idea in a 1.7.2 uh, patch, because um, minecarts are kind of bugged. When you hop out, you end up about four blocks away from that minecart. So when I got out, I fell out of my tunnel, and where I, so I fell down actually quite a bit, and uh, I was down to four hearts, and there were a couple more zombie pigmen that were aggroed because I killed the guy that was standing in front of my pickaxe. And also, there were quite a few ghosts, so I died again. Um, four times to be exact, um, until I gave up and just said, F it, um, I'm not gonna bother getting my stuff back. Um, let me quickly, this is the outside of the tunnel, I'll, I'll show you the rest in a bit. But you can see the guy right there at the end of the tunnel is my portal obviously so I fell down from there to there and because I had the protection on my armor I didn't completely die but you know all the fire because of the gas balls and the zombie pigman knocking me back into the fire I died and I started a little bit of a death loop again and this guy there has my armor he's still aggro at least I think he is, and there are maybe one or two more somewhere down here. So I lost I lost a good amount of diamonds and all the enchantments on it. But yeah, this is the outside of the tunnel that I made for myself. Looks pretty derpy, especially you know the cobblestone actually looks pretty good, um, even though you're not supposed to see this from the outside. But I just put a couple stone there so I could put the logs there, the dark oak logs. And uh why am I missing one? Let's just grab one. Whoops. So um yeah, this this is my tunnel. Uh, nice in the new room that I made previous episode. I used the uh, red stained clay to kind of block it off. And I have a couple of minecarts over here. But if you exit the one here, you'll end up in this corner here. Which is, as you can see, a couple blocks away. But if you do that on the other side, you are basically screwed because you fall out. Um can see it ends right here and you drop somewhere outside this ball which is not cool um, I'm not gonna take a right I was gonna show you guys how it would no it's not too long of a, a tunnel uh, but it doesn't look too great either I really haven't thought about this designer just did it and this is what happened looks decent Wait, let's not go back and also this bugs here if you walk in a specific angle which is basically straight you can skip these one gaps these one block gaps where the levers are for the power tracks but yeah that's basically why I was at the skeleton grinder I was hoping we'd have an ender grinder by now because oh, you're gonna be so irritating 
because um, you know the reason I came up with uh, like I'll do the nether hub because somebody said they were gonna make the ender grinder but they still haven't done it and it, it's been a couple of weeks and uh, the nether hub took quite a while because you know I can't play Minecraft 24 7 because of work and school and other games um, but yeah it's not cool and especially because the skeleton grinder isn't really the isn't the fastest XP you can get as you can see it says 67 entities right now but I'm pretty sure there are only like 10 or 20 in there let's just quickly dem demonstrate you guys so this up oh, please get out I don't want to have to kill you and die myself again but so you know it just burns up it's even says 110 entities plus and I stand right here so let's kill you guys I'm just using this iron sword because I have too many anyways but yeah like I said there were only 10 in here so I don't know where those entities are then like why are there entities right here I, I can't see them what's in here lots of stuff okay uh yeah so this really isn't fast at all and I'm gonna have to enchant basically four pieces of armor a sword and two tools so uh, I'm gonna be here for a little while and uh, see how far I'll go before I continue doing uh, you know some building but I just wanted to show you guys that I died again and I'm a sad panda and uh, I'll be right back to show you uh, what we're gonna do next alright good morning good day squad um, back on the SW city server awesome server and uh, I did some enchanting let me just quickly hop through this portal <coughs> before I show you guys ooh it's night um, let's take a quick nap first because we don't want to be attacked by the bad guys come on go through but yeah so I did some enchanting Di mm, didn't really get the most amazing enchants uh, sword sharpness 4 knockback 2 not great pain of arthropods 4 and unbreaking 3 again not great and this is the sword I already had the cow killing machine I got a uh, twerker junior fishy 4 and breaking 3 pickaxe and a silk touch and breaking 3 shovel that's okay I guess uh, got a decent bow at least it will survive for a long while and uh, have some decent power to it uh, protection on my boots projectile protection on breaking leggings fire protection chest kind of useless I guess and protection and aqua affinity now I don't really know the differences between the helmet enchantments I think aqua affinity is that you can see better underwater let's see if we can check that out real quick no it's actually that you can mine faster in the water that's that's cool I guess for well I it's cool for when you're in need of clay and it's a little bit down under water but no respiration sadly but I was thinking to myself like in real life I kinda want to have my own place to live um, in the coming year I'm not sure if I'm gonna make that but you know I kinda wanted to just set that as a goal and see how far we can get um, cause you know it's I guess I still live at home with my parents I um, and I work at night 
which is 5 p.m. to somewhere around 11 p.m. After work, I can't record anymore because you know my parents will be in bed, and uh, I don't want to wake them up. Um, so I can only record if I have to work. I can only record before I go to work, and um, you know I don't get up before 11 a.m. usually. So I don't always have the m most time, which is, you know, kind of sad. What am I looking for, by the way? I have no idea. Quartz, maybe? Where did I leave my quartz? But yeah, if I get my own place, I can actually record again after work. So that's kind of what, what I want to be going for. Uh, oh, today was kind of a weird day. I didn't wake up until 2.20 p.m. You know, in the afternoon. Because I found out that my alarm didn't work. Uh, okay. Um, and now that we're talking about getting our own place, I want to build a house uh, on here. Which is mm, a little bit of a villa. It's bigger than these couple houses because you know it's gonna be mine and I have a couple ideas for it I kind of build it in creative so I'm gonna quickly um, set up a chest see where exactly I'll be building that house and uh, get my supplies ready so I'll be right back okay so <coughs> I just quickly I uh, went to bed to clear the night so we could start. I put these stairs here and these dark oak planks here. Because uh, that way we kind of have an idea of where we're going to have to build. Now, because this is kind of, at least I'm trying to kind of make an ancient Roman settlement. This is kind of an ancient Roman house slash villa. It's not really the biggest, but it should do the trick. And we can always add, uh, you know, a basement to it. Um. So let's. It's kind of a hard build because it's you no. Know, not really the smallest and also I had to clear away a little bit of that land and add quite a bit over here because we're gonna need the space I'm gonna have to see how we can work this out exactly because you no know, it worked all fine in the creative world but we might need a little bit of room extra here. Now I'll fill that pond uh, with grass again and probably uh, connect that. And uh, we'll see how far we can get. So this is basically going to be the front of the house. Which is why we're facing it that way. Now I was thinking of every house facing towards the temple but I guess this is gonna be my house I'm gonna do it a little bit different and also I still have an offer running for the guys on the server that I still need a lot of quartz so I'm not sure what the deal was was 32 quartz per diamond that might have been it. I might have just said it wrong in scripture, but that's okay. You guys don't have to worry about that. But let's see, spiller here. Now I'm gonna need some chiseled, which is I have no idea how to make chiseled. Can we even make chiseled? Because if we can't, I'm gonna have to change it up a little bit. Uh, but that's okay. Um, oh, we'll just leave it like that, I guess, for now. 
Yeah. Uh, if you hear some noises from outside, it's because I have my window open. Because it was a little bit smelly in here. We don't want that, so you might have just heard a child cry or something. Whatever that was. Um. <coughs> Excuse me. So, it's a little bit of a weird building. There's no real symmetry to every part. I mean, this is symmetric. But then we have this little thing that's going to be like that. And then we have a little bit of a doorway over here. And that's pretty high. And we got the wall coming out like that far. And... Mm. Yeah, that's good. Now this, how far does this go? I believe it's four. And we have another window. Get rid of these. Um, I don't want to get rid of too much near the temple. Because I don't want it to be like suddenly you drop. Even though it's just one block, it's it wouldn't wound. It wouldn't really look too great. Now uh, it goes until there, and let's see. Um. gonna do this mostly out of these hardened clay blocks that aren't colored because they're just amazing I think whoops don't go there now we also got a few colored blocks of these stained uh, yeah the actual stained clay in this build uh, there's gonna be one there 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 and there and then some half slabs underneath those I'm not gonna use windows um, with actual glass I'm just gonna use half slabs to prevent mobs from coming in but I wanted to keep this as open as possible so we're not gonna use not really gonna use doors at least uh, this is gonna be open uh, there's going to be a little bit of you no know, bedroom over there, so there's going to be a room, uh, I mean a door over there. So we won't get the error message that we can't sleep because there are mobs nearby. And, um, I think I'm just going to fill things temporarily with dirt where normally the chisel would go just so we can continue this part now we take you guys um, also on this side and so yeah it's gonna be chiseled right there it's gonna be the pillars are gonna continue to go up here so let's make some more that's good for now now these are gonna go up four high. And you're only gonna see three and a half because of the roof. Oops. Get rid. Get rid. Um, two, three, four, and again fill this in with hardened clay. I have no idea if we have enough. I hope we do. Cause. Uh, Chris reset the server um, thingies. The you no, know, he deleted the wrong chunks. Um, but he said that the algorithm for generating biomes should still be the same. So if I still go somewhere over there, this should spawn another savanna and mesa biome next to each other now i'm not sure about that but he said it so we'll have to check that out later um i did something wrong 
I did something wrong over here. These, oh, damn it. These will be dirt for now. Ah, not again. And it's gonna be this. Now, let's see. So that part and the shunt, the shunt, the front should be done, kind of. So let's just quickly do that. Get rid let's eat. Um, window over there again. Yes, over there. Get down. Put a half slap. Uh, there. Ah, how does that look? It looks kind of ugly with the dirt, and also because it's not done at all. But and it's very flat. That's one thing that I did with this building is to keep everything very flat. And um, you know we kind of have like the the logs sticking out over there, but I felt that. Um, you know, because I kind of like to work with shadows and depth. Um, I felt that that didn't really work in this building, or wouldn't really work. So I kept that away from this. Now, as you can see, we can't go through here, so the mobs won't be able to either. Maybe you know, only the poison spiders, but those don't belong here now uh, in here like about here there's gonna be a little bit of a swimming pool slash bath it's now the ancient Roman houses shut up kid uh, the ancient Roman houses quite often had you know a little bit of a bath somewhere and a garden somewhere with a roof over top it open so I did that in this building. And, uh, ooh, um, so we're gonna do that on this server as well. Um, I also added some torches to the bases of these pillars in the temple. Now, um, this is probably one thing that I'm gonna change to the glowstone and maybe some. Um, stained glass above it to kinda hide it but I think it looks pretty cool you know with the, the spotlights at the base maybe at the top but I feel that would light up the whole pillar so I'm gonna have to uh, work something out because I want it to stand oh excuse me I got the hiccups um, but I wanted the temple to stand out so we're not gonna use too many torches in these buildings. You know they kind of have a little bit, but they don't um, show up too much around it. And this is just bright because of the quartz. And I think that looks pretty cool. And maybe we're gonna add something in the triangle. I don't know if I've said that before, but maybe some kind of you no, know, a teeny tiny pixel art. Maybe, maybe the LT in there. That would be pretty cool, actually. But yeah, we'll see. I'm gonna quickly check my creative world again so we can continue this build. And I'll be right back. Okay, so uh, when I wanted to log back into the server, um, it said the authentication servers were down. And I kinda just want to finish this video real quick. So we're back in my creative world. You can see the temple over there, which is the wrong temple. It's not high enough my tryouts for the, you know, the houses very ugly and this is what we have now that is secret I'm not gonna tell you about that and this is just something that I've been working on because I was bored yesterday um, I was thinking about building a huge villa and I hope you guys won't steal this idea because I want to be the first but now just messing around 
with because it's gonna be big you can have bigger pillars and I don't want them to be square still so and doing it like this actually creates some shadow itself on the pillars because you know you kind of have these lines uh, these vertical lines in the pillars but now you have it even more with the shadows so I think that looks pretty good but yeah we can't go back into the SW City server right now I hope it'll be up very soon so I can continue building but I'm gonna have to leave you guys uh, here we'll continue building in the next episode uh, I hope you liked it I hope you can kinda see what I'm doing with the building even though it's nothing yet but uh, you guys will definitely see something more in the next episode uh, but that's it I'm going away I'll fly away now and uh, I'll see you next time